For today's interview, I'd like you to explain the difference between caching and a CDN. I right, bet. Imagine this. I'm chilling with my girlfriend watching Netflix. Caching is basically storing frequently accessed data closer to where it's needed so that the time to retrieval is faster. Now, let's say I pause the episode midway through to chill. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Netflix is going to cache exactly where I was at and they don't have to ask their servers. That was an interesting example. I'm, I'm not sure how to proceed. A CDN, however, is a content delivery network. So that's like a distributed system of service that delivers content from places that are closer to the user. So like when I'm Netflix, and chilling with my girl, I don't have to stream it from the server in Japan. I can just get the one closest to me in the US. That's just going to keep things nice and smooth. This is really good. Tell me the downsides and challenges with each one. Problem with this is caching can show stale data. Like what I mean by this is if Netflix updates your recommendations, but the old list is still cached on your phone, that's the list you're going to see. And then CDNs have consistency issues. When a new episode drops, it takes time to reach all the servers. So some people around the world might see the episode before others. How do you invalidate or update cache content? Like what do companies actually use? For caching, you set the TTL, which is time to live. So data expires automatically automatically or you manually clear it when updates happen. Popular tools include Redis for in-memory caching, maybe like Memcache for distributed caching, and then browser caching for client side. For CDNs, companies use tools like Cloudflare or AWS CloudFront, basically to push updates and to invalidate like old content globally. Young man, you are the most impressive intern I've seen. How did you learn all this? Man, I just do a bunch of projects. I go to learn.nextwork.org. If I don't know something, I try and do a project on it. This website's pretty damn good. You've got the job. Thanks, bro. I appreciate you. Type.